Welcome to the finals. Let's go ahead and choose to play first. In this hand, I won mullet. First, because, you know, like I've said many times already, my. Uh, the mana in my deck is not as smooth. And, you know, here I got multiple forests and mountains. And also because I really want to, to get to play with this thing. It seemed like a pretty good card that I. Still haven't had hit the battlefield in any meaningful situation until now. Let's hope I manage to do it now. Alright, so that's a sort of a mirror match. Oh, Impetuous Sun Chaser. I wonder how good that guy is. I mean, it's a flyer, right? Mm, keep going, man. It's man. I was gonna say, it's a flyer. Uh, you, know, you know, it constantly pings people, and with. The amount of enchantments and auras that are in this block here. You could even, you know, you could even get some mileage out of this thing. Oh, fall off the hammer, sure. Another target creature, sure. And I keep drawing lands, which kind of shows me where this, this game is going. <laughs> Alright, let's hope I manage to at least attack with my my spirit binder. Which I'm not sure is gonna happen. Let's see if he can muster something as impressive as my guy. Maybe he has a removal spell. Although I cannot think which removal spell he could have to do with the you know four toughness guy with four mana. On the battlefield in, in in that combination of colors, but not overly overly experienced with this format. All right, he's just per win eighteen. So maybe I would draw into a null end right now. No, that's kind of too much to to hope for, right? No magic online. All right, that's actually not bad. It's bashing for three. Next turn we can at least make a copy of the Sun Chaser, which is Icarus, by the way. If you know your Greek mythology like I do. <laughs> Although you don't really even need to know Greek mythology in any meaningful degree to know that this is a, a not to Icarus. Alright, so he's simply attacking as of right now. I guess he's maybe afraid of giving me a target for my spirit binder, but that doesn't really make much sense to me. I mean, what's he gonna do? Just not play creatures or only play terrible ones so that I can not take advantage of the ability? Seems kind of far fetched. Uh, Alright. Pragma Butcher. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to copy his guy, and leave mana open to shoot his Minotaur if I need to. Alright, that giant will come in handy eventually. Let's attack. I'm, I'm thinking he might have some sort of combat trick, and if he does, then we're definitely going to get him here. <clears throat> Let's see. All right. Apparently he doesn't. This guy is going to be slightly annoying, though, due to his ability. Hmm. I'm thinking when I play this this thing, that would actually be pretty awesome <laughs> because I'll be able to, you know, copy it every turn. <laughs> As a five-five, because he will not want to be taking five damage to the dom, but you know it won't really matter because my guy will have haste. So, <laughs> all right, so sure. Is is he attacking? Yeah. Oh, he needs to attack. Sure. Yeah, I think. Oh, it's a sorcery, yeah. I keep forgetting about that. Alright. 
so I will not make a token now. Or will I? Man, I'm I'm not thinking straight. I won't have enough mana to play this thing and shoot something. So I really should make a copy and in that case we make a copy of this guy, not this one. Anyway. Alright, that's that that's fine. I don't wanna take four damage next turn, so let's think here about what I should do. Maybe I should just, you know, man up and take the damage. Mm. If I draw into another mountain here, eventually I get to shoot him for eight during a single turn. I should kill him. So I'm gonna take six damage plus four due to that guy. Yeah, you know what? I think I'm probably just better off shooting this guy already. Only taking four, he's gonna play something, I'm gonna copy it and deal five to his face. Oh I cannot deal five to his face. <laughs> oh man, I keep forgetting about all those little intricacies. Thing is if this guy is like a six two and if he removes my guy, then I'm gonna be pretty screwed. So I think it's just better to shoot that guy. I'm trying to so salvage this turn here. Hmm, that. Alright, that could work. <clears throat> so let's see, he's gonna do 4 damage and hopefully get play something big, which I'll be able to then copy. Kill his his big thing and attack for the win. Maybe he plays his own Faragax Giant. That'd be cool. Oh, he has a Phoenix. That is pretty interesting. It is a five five, right? Gains haste. Alright, I don't want that thing to gain haste, so I will put two counters on it. Then I will copy it, then he will get to choose and obviously give it haste. <laughs> so let's see, I'm taking four damage here. Copying his Phoenix, shooting him. Alright, that thing. Let's copy the Phoenix then. Then shoot him and play a Sin Tower. Let's see whether he chooses to give the Phoenix plus. Oh, he did. That's pretty interesting. <laughs> Alright. Uh, one, two, three, four. Get rid of that thing. He's not going to be able to pump its stuffiness with one mountain up, especially because right, this bottom is on top. Especially because this is not Theros. So he has to block. He, he say he clicked that wrong, and I, I could see it. <laughs> so now he has to block, and I'll play a. Uh, since I and hope he doesn't have a burn spell, which he might. <laughs> Alright. Down to three he is. <coughs> Sorry about that. Stay this guy, say go. If he has a burn spell, he got it. If he has a pump spell, he got it. The one that gives plus two plus zero. And otherwise I think I think I I got it. He has two cards in hand, come on. He will not have a burn spell. Maybe he will. Yep. Alright. That was unfortunate, but it was a good game at least. Uh let's see. That thing 
uh, scouring sands. He has the wolf, he has the flyer. What else could I bring in? I'm ready for the ether. I think this guy could actually be quite decent, better than this one maybe. Alright, and the question is do I bring that thing in? I, I think I don't. I think I got enough ways to remove the wolf of his. Alright, let's go ahead and play first, and no, I'm not gonna mow this. I mean, a removal spell on a very good creature should make up for, you know, many lands yet again. <laughs> I'm playing a forest there because I doubt I will need to see me blue anything right now, and yeah. And if I drew the sand tower, I would have wanted to play it. At least I did not draw into land. Alright, he didn't have anything. And. Let's play this guy, see what he thinks about it. Thinking he will give it plus one, plus one, and haste. Oh no, he, he actually gave it the counter. That is pretty interesting. Does he have a removal spell? I doubt it. No one could deal with that. Alright, let's attack then. Then we get to play a peregrination and next turn the snake is gonna come in and presumably gain me four life. Let's choose a couple of forests there. Uh, this is going to go on the bottom. I don't really want it. So is he going to play his own 4-4? Four, four? Or no, his, his own peregrination, sure. He's looking to, to get a big turn. When he untaps. And with 7 cards in hand, I'm pretty sure he might. Let's hope whatever he plays isn't that scary. All right, that's that's great actually. Let's play this thing already. Next turn I get to play this thing plus this thing thanks to the mountain that I have. So now it's going to give me a life. Yes, like I thought. So I have a couple of four fours on the battlefield, and they will soon have first strike, which goes very well with instant speed burn spells to take out opposing giants. Hmm, that thing, sure. All right, so it's gonna play a giant, all right. Man, I do hope he blocks. It's going to be so awesome. Oh, it's Trample. It's not First Strike. Why was I thinking it would give my guy First Strike? Anyway, I will attack because I'm going to be trading 2 for 2 plus 3 damage to his face. This is not a uh, enchant creature. Alright, so... Oh, all right. He did block. Let's do this. I'm gonna take a few damage, and I'm going to play this thing in order to draw more cards here. Yeah, I land, like I thought. At least I took that <laughs> out of the top. So let's see what he does. I think he's in 
quite a sticky situation here. That's probably a removal spell, right? This, the. Oh, alright, that thing. And that thing. Doesn't have trample, by the way. <laughs> alright. Ah, oh, man, that's annoying, but what you gonna do? Maybe he's gonna double block my guy? Alright, that's a land. I really did not want to draw a land right now. If he wants to trade one for two, then be my guest. Yeah, but like I thought, he did not. I mean, that's even luckier because he got to kill the guy that was giving trample to my guy. So he would not be able to just go ahead and jump it like that. Oh. Alright. Well. I'm certainly not going to pay, pay, tribu pay tribute there. If he wants to attack me for 8, then be my guest. Although I don't think he will. Yeah. Okay. There's that guy. So now we are in a board stall. But the good news is actually that Uh, he's, he has 5 life and I have 21. If he attacks with both, I'm definitely blocking. Oh, another one? Come on, man. Alright, now I'm blocking. Definitely blocking. If he has a combat trick, so be it. One more card in hand. Oh, another one. Sure. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> yeah. My thing there would give me three mana. Which <laughs> should make him scared for, for a while here. <laughs> Wait, there's no need. So I'm taking eight. Plus whatever he, he draws there. Not feeling it for this game. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and lose. Or at least he's doing to land. So my plan here is actually to take nine damage and hope to draw into a combat trick or some sort of burn spell to aim at his face. Although I don't have a burn spell anymore, do I? I do. I'm gonna do three damage. So if he attacks me with both, I get to attack him back. Oh, I mean another one. Oh, it's the both of Karanus this time. Sure. Yeah, that's problematic. Cannot see a way to... Oh well. Did lose in the finals, but... It was good experience. I will definitely be recording more of this. Hope you enjoyed it. And see you soon.